Hi, Alex here from Rebeloper.com and welcome back to this advent calendar tutorial series. And in this episode, I am going to show you how you can create a universally sized SKC. So let's get started. When you create a default game template with Xcode, you get an SK file that has a size. Now that size is set up statically, so no dynamic scales for our scenes. But we can change this in code. So first things first, we need to commit our day two's changes. So created day two, and let's push to remote and let's just wait for it. Okay, and now I would just create a new branch from the current day, for the current day, day three. Okay, and we are inside our day three current branch. Good stuff. Okay, now what we need to do is go into our game view controller and let's just delete this and let's create a scene. But before we do that, uh, we need to, let's just delete this, we need to create our main menu scene. So let's click on new file and let's just create a new Swift file and I will just name it main menu. Okay. And I will import here sprite kit and let's create a new class named main menu and its super class will be sk scene and let's add our did move to view with a print statement of one two three good stuff okay now let's go back to our game view controller and let's initialize our scene here so let scene equals to main and let's just build so we may get the completions here main menu and we will initialize it with this size property so i will choose cg size and this one so we need to add our width and we will use screen size dot width and screen size dot height and as you might remember in the previous episode we have created this in our extensions okay now we need to set our scale mode so scene dot scale mode equals to and i will choose aspect fill okay and finally we are going to add or present this scene on our sk view so sk view dot present scene scene okay and finally we need to ignore siblings order on our ignore siblings order on our sk view okay equals to true now let's just build and run this and we should get uh, the one two three in our log and then this gray, dark grayish background on our uh, simulator and that is what we have got and, and uh, this is how simple it is to add a universal or a dynamic screen sized uh, SK scenes into your apps hope you like this video if you did go ahead and give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already done so go ahead and click on the subscribe button to get notified of new videos in my brand new advent calendar tutorial series and maybe tap on that uh, bell button to get notified via email of every new uploads i do daily on this channel okay hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next one